welcome back. It's Brittany with Brits Dips. Today I am doing all things glitter dip Manny. All things glitter, super cute company out in Hawaii, owned by Jessica. Um, I actually have purchased a few of her dips a long, long time ago, and I have used so many different colors in multiple different Manny's. I love the quality of her products and I'm excited to share them with you today. If you are interested, check out her website. She has a really cute website. Lots of different options. She has some thermals on there. Brit, B-R-I-T-T, 2020, B-R-I-T-T, 20 will save you 20%. We're going to get into it. We're going to do some color blocking today. I am going to use my Shenzhen color blocking tape as always. I'm going to rip off a piece and go ahead and place it how I want it. All right, I got it. I am ready to go. So I am going to do gold on the tip and this mint color up in the nail bed. So the mint color is called Love in a Mist. Super, super pretty. And then the gold color is called Pop Fizzle Clink. I freaking love it. Oh my god. Oh, it looks even prettier under the light. For my liquids today, I'm using Gel Liquids, Eye Gel Beauty Base, and Gel Top Coat. So I'm just applying a thin layer to the tip there. I'm going to try my hardest not to make a mess today. All right, I'm going to go ahead and cure that. All right, brush off the excess here, and we will do our second layer. Look how pretty that is. I love the iridescent shimmer. Ugh. Guys, it does not get any easier than that. Oh my god, it's gorgeous too. It's so pretty. All right, I'm going to cure it for a full minute. All right, dusting off the excess here. Okay, so I did two layers of Pop Fizz Clink. Super pretty. I am going to put um, Love in a Mist up in this area here. I like to kind of cap off um, when I do color blocking just to prevent um, if I have any like overlap happening of color just to kind of protect it a little bit. So I'm going to do a layer of gel base, um, cure for a minute, gel top coat, cure for a minute. But I'm doing a very, very thin layer because once I do have both um, the colors here and meeting together, um, I will do... An entire layer over top of it too so all right I am gonna go ahead with love in a mist super pretty sagey mint green color it has this really light shimmer to it too really pretty um, so I am gonna butt it up against this color blocking here I don't trust my hands, and I'm pretty shaky, honestly, um, especially when it comes to, like, trying not to be. <laughs> so I'm just going to use, like, an angled brush to kind of get in real close. I love this. You can see how fine this powder is. All right, I'm going to go ahead and do two more layers of that. All right, I'm going to go ahead in with a gel base and gel top coat over this entire nail. Okay. Now I'm going to go ahead in with a solid of Love in a Mist on my index finger. Alright, I'm going to go ahead in with a base coat and top coat. Cure each for one minute. 
All right, I'm gonna go ahead in with three solid layers of Up in the Clouds to my middle finger. All right, gonna go ahead in with a layer of base and a layer of top coat here for a minute. All right, I think I'm gonna go ahead and do Pop Fizz Clank a solid on my pinky. Okay, I'm going to go ahead in with a layer of gel base and gel top coat, and I'm going to cure for one minute. Okay, I think I am going to do up in the clouds solid on my thumb. I'm going to go ahead with two layers of that. All right, I'm going to do a gel base and top coat cure for one minute each. While I'm curing that in the lamp, I wanted to share with you guys how I clean up my disaster of glitter. So, like, this glitter doesn't have an easy time coming off with just a brush because I have like a silicone mat now so instead of like getting a washcloth or anything like that I just take an alcohol swab which is really nice too because it sanitizes it <laughs> Brand new. All right, I'm going to go ahead and buff and file. Okay, I think I'm going to do some um, gold glitter in an arch on my mint finger. So to do that, I'm going to get a plate and a line brush. I'll dip out some of the gel base onto the plate. Get our glitter ready. I think it's good enough. I really like it. Okay, I'm going to do a gel base and cure for a minute, gel top coat, cure for a minute, and I think we're going to be done. All right, I am all done. I think it came out really, really cute. Love this little accent nail that I did. Um, check out her shop, All Things Glitter. I really um, enjoy working with her powders. 
her solids and her glitters are super, super easy to use. I mean, have you ever seen a more easy um, color blocking done before? And this glitter, I filed the crap out of it and it did not lose a single color of pigment. It is gorgeous and smooth as a baby's butt. <laughs> All right, guys, uh, let me know if you have any questions. I hope you enjoyed this. As always, I will catch you next time. Bye.